This is an ABC 10 News update. And good evening, I'm Steve Atkinson in the ABC 10 News studio. Pfizer's COVID vaccine is now one step closer to authorization for younger children. An FDA panel of independent doctors and experts voted 17 to 0 Tuesday in favor of the authorization. Pfizer's clinical trials showed the vaccine is 90.7% effective in kids ages 5 through 11 after two doses. The CDC and the FDA will be deciding whether to issue that emergency authorization. If both sign off, kids could get vaccinated as early as next week. The city council is keeping outdoor dining as a permanent part of San Diego. Council members voted Tuesday to approve the Spaces as Places program. So this will keep on street dining created in response to the pandemic now permanent. The Spaces as Places program also requires businesses to comply with fire, stormwater and ADA codes or risk facing daily fines. San Diego County is urging swimmers and surfers to stay out of the coastal beaches and bays after Monday's rain. The County Department of Environmental Health and Quality issued a general rain advisory Tuesday. This is because of increased bacteria levels from urban runoff. The runoff may contain bacteria from a sources like animal waste and soil. The department says water contact should be avoided for 72 hours after that rainfall. That's the bad part, but good part was we got much needed rain. Here's Angelica. That's right, Steve. And as we go into the next couple of days, temperatures will be heating up. You can see tomorrow upper 70s at the coast, 80s inland, and this is just the beginning. The beginning temperatures will peak on Thursday as well as the Santa Ana winds will have much more coming up.